and let's just center this so it looks nice and we'll click share story. So there we go. I, as you know, a fan, a follower, whatever of this page, of this Instagram account, I've promoted the brand to my followers. I've shared it on my story. And now here we go. I get that response as the user. Hi there folks, Andrew here at Chatfuel, and today we're gonna to be talking about the story mention entry point. Now, if you've used Facebook Messenger automation in the past, you know that this is not something that's supported on Facebook. This is an exclusive feature to Instagram, and that's what makes it so exciting. You're gonna love this feature, you're gonna love this entry point if you're trying to increase the word of mouth promotion for your business. So that being said, let's dive in here and show you how it works. There's really two ways that you can use this. You can use it in a very simple and generic way, or you can get a little bit more advanced and use it in a much more clever way. So I'm gonna show you both of those things right now. Let's dive in. Step one here is you definitely want to create an Instagram flow in Flow Builder, which I've already done. So you can see that right here. Just click the plus button and add an Instagram flow. You'll be all set. And now that I've done that, I'm going to collapse the side panel here to give us some more working real estate. And now let's add the story mention entry point. To do that, I'm gonna double click here on the canvas and choose, you guessed it, story mention as the entry point. And I'll zoom in here so we get a better view. Now, with the story mention, it's very important to note that this will only work for people who are mentioning your brand who have public profiles. So in other words, if you are trying to respond to someone, if you want the bot to respond to someone who is mentioning your brand but they have a private account, this will not unfortunately work. This is simply just a Facebook limitation, an Instagram limitation, there's nothing we can do about that, but important to keep in mind. So now that we have this story mention entry point set up, we're going to send a message in response to people who mention us in their story. So to do that, we're going to click the red connector right here, click and drag it over, and we'll send a message. And we can just say something generic like, thanks for the mention. And if we wanted to, we could get more advanced and add some quick replies here, giving the user some different options, like if they need to ask a question for support, or if they want a coupon code, whatever sort of menu of options you wanna offer, you could also do that here. But in this case, let's keep it super simple and just say thanks for the mention in response to somebody who mentions us on their story. And then the last step here, we want to click where it says inactive here to toggle on the entry point. So now this means it's active and anyone who mentions us on their story will again get this response. Pretty simple stuff so far. So now let's go over to my phone and I'm going to mention the brand the Instagram handle in my story and show you just how this works in the wild. So here we go, I'm going to click add story and I'll just take a photo here and I'll mention that account which is at test Demeter and let's just center this so it looks nice and we'll click share story. So there we go, I as you know a fan, a follower, whatever of this page, of this Instagram account, I've promoted the brand to my followers. I've shared it on my story. And now here we go. I get that response as the user. So again, super simple here. Now the downside of this is that this is obviously just super generic, right? Because you can right now only have one generic, one standardized response for anyone who mentions your brand. And this can be potentially problematic because let's say, one user is mentioning your brand because they had an amazing experience and they wanna share that, whereas another user is mentioning your brand because they had an awful experience and they need customer service. So because of that, you may not always wanna send just a generic response here. And for that reason, another use case of the story mention entry point that really excites me is using it for giveaways because as I mentioned earlier, a prime example of using this is to spread virality and word of mouth about your business. So I'm gonna show you another workflow that's a little bit more advanced, but a great use of this feature as well. So what I'm gonna do is delete this story mention entry point and the text we just created. And in this example, again, let's show a giveaway use case in action. So what I'm gonna do is double click here on the canvas and we'll click send message. 
and this will be the beginning of our giveaway workflow here, let's say. So in this case, let's keep it again super simple and we'll just ask the user, what's your email? Let's add a space here. There we go, what's your email? We'll save this to an email address and this will be the condition for them entering the giveaway, right? Pretty straightforward. So then after they enter the email, I'm going to say, add some text, thanks for entering the giveaway. And then we'll add one more message. If you'd like to earn a bonus entry, then tag us in your story, right? Simple enough. So they enter the giveaway, we say thanks, and then we tell them, hey, if you wanna increase your odds of winning, mention us in your story, because obviously in so doing, they are promoting that word of mouth for the business and spreading the word to their own followers and kind of creating this viral feedback loop, if you will. So then finally here, we're going to add an attribute and this will make more sense in a second. So we're going to add an attribute here under bot action and set user attribute and we'll call this giveaway and we'll set it to true just indicating that hey this is a user who entered the giveaway so again i know this is a little bit more advanced but stick with me trust me it'll be worth it so the user has provided their email they've entered the giveaway we're tagging them as somebody who's entered the giveaway and now what we're going to do is again add that story mention entry point so i'm going to double click here add story mention and then the difference now, instead of just sending that same generic standardized message to everyone, we're going to add a condition so that only users who have entered the giveaway and users who mentioned us will get this next response. So I'm going to drag on the connector again and instead of going right to the text message, I'm going to add a condition here. And in this condition, we're going to add that attribute we just created, giveaway is true. So we'll type in giveaway is true and then connect this to the final message where we can say, hey, thanks for earning your bonus, your additional entry, right? So we'll say that now. You just earned a bonus entry. You know, congrats, you get the idea. And then if we really wanted to get advanced, of course, we could send all of this to a Google Sheet. So we're actually tracking, you know, hey, this person earned one entry, this person earned two because they tagged us in their story, etc. All right, great. So now that we've set up the workflow here in ChatFuel, let's head on over to Instagram and show you what all of this looks like from the user's perspective. So here we are on the brand's Instagram profile. And first we need to initiate that giveaway flow. So I'm gonna click message here and send a keyword to initiate this conversation that I set up in ChatFuel under the setup AI tab. So here we go, I'm gonna type in the keyword giveaway to initiate that workflow. And in a second here, it'll ask for my email address. So there we go. I'll type Demeter at chatfuel.com. And then it'll say, hey, thanks, you've entered the giveaway. So there we go, you've entered the giveaway. If you'd like to earn a bonus entry, tag us in your story. So now I'm gonna do just that. So I'm gonna go back home here and let's click the plus button, create a story, we will again tag the account here, which is test Demeter. Okay, great. We'll again center this just so it looks nice. Share story. And now again, instead of getting that same generic response, we'll get the more targeted, the more personalized, the more tailored message here in just a second. So there we go. And wonderful, right? You just earned a bonus entry. So. In short, this is how you can use the story mention entry point, which is exclusive and brand new just for Instagram DM automation. It's super exciting. It's a great way to spread that virality, that word of mouth about your business and about your brand. If you have any questions whatsoever, please leave them down below in the comments. And until next time, happy botting.